tension in the hips as much as possible. Try to relax your lower body. No! No, 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 no! No, 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 no! No, 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 no! No, 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 no! morning everyone it is the next morning and I just want to change up the the environment the atmosphere where I want to do some planning at so I'm gonna take this outside Notice I got the dog's name in there too. You got Shannon, Shannon, Shannon. Shannon, Shannon reads their name. Oh, dang. She walked fast though. That was nice, right? Mm hmm? It's a dog over there, that's why I had to pick him up. Stay over here and leave Blue Bear alone. Jesus Christ. You ain't humping anything. Don't put that in the video. Excuse my, excuse my language. You're not banging anything. They still my album too. <laughs> Oh, it's nice going out. It is, right? Yeah. Okay, so we just left the dog park. I have Blue with me in the van. And the Clever is with Laquan in his car. <laughs> 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 
the way to drop the pups off and try to get some lunch right now because it is um 409 um time went back so i thought it was 509 um and right now we're just driving <laughs> and the sun is out and beaming did some stretches um, and we just enjoyed nature and it's fresh air and to get some deep breaths and um, you know just had a pretty good time while we were out there um, meeting new people talking to different people um, and it was just it was just good, it was good. so um, being out there today at the park was really good I love that the Sun is shining very bright on my natural beautiful skin <laughs> a nice little glow. You know, I just can't get enough of it. <laughs> Peace of mind. My like Jim Ron said, of course. Peace of mind. But then don't start. Okay. So transitioning my lifestyle to where I wear, to where I am, to where I want to be, it's going to take a lot of focus. So I believe in... Ah! Go to your bed. Your bed. Sit. Thank you. I hate to tell him to go to his bed like that, but he, he keeps shaking the, the bed and it's making it like wiggling. And the camera is just wiggling and my coffee or my, my Santa Santa's cocoa is just wiggling everywhere. So <sighs> So we're now talking about the mind, the cognitive. So we have so much that enters our mind every single day, every single hour, from eyes, from our eyes, our sights, from our ears, from our from my feelings, from my smell, from all of our senses. We have this all entering our mind. And it's just boggled up and we intake so much things every day. And sometimes it can be straining. Our mind is cluttered. So how can we detox that? Well, better planning and organizing. Some people, they procrastinate, um, get to it at a later time, and then it's boom, 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 and then they're behind. And it's it tends to, you know, make a bad day or a slow start of a day and it doesn't even have to be like that so basically go by your go by have so make a schedule go by good time um start everything that you do finish everything that you do accomplish those little steps those little goals and then go ahead and check them off your list um and that that task has been completed and that's what causes a productive day so what we started to do was or what I started to do was plan organize um, declutter my desk declutter everything mentally and just meditate and read do some yoga some stretches and just just relax mentally I have some sticky notes on hand when I wrote when I said Santa Coco instead of forgetting it and forgetting that I actually wrote it down so I can look at it and I can say hey Santa's Coco get yourself a planner the planners fell back here I did not know that this is a planner that I have um let's see and this is how I detox mentally I've also have a little financial journal that I have for myself um, and I also have my old, which which is new but old because uh, I have November and December left within this planner. This is the planner that I have from Ohio. Um, November and December is left. And this is for my finances. This is for my finances as well. And this is for YouTube's 
and current events situations like that that's going on that's happening and i also have it going on in here so starting with this planner it's by me over here it has the holidays so i am not late on my holidays um i actually can write down in my special dates the birthdays and everything um and this is for 2020 but then it also transitioned into 2021 so from january 2021 to december 2021 and that is the new beginning in this planner i have my goal tracker here and then i'm setting goals for myself it's to really start november the 20th and then whenever um we get to the first day of january what titles am i going to put here to um go there that i really 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 want to focus on and really 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 want to jot down and take um, where I can actually pros progress in this. I don't know if it's going to be finances. I don't know if it's going to be water. I don't know if it's going to be vitamins, readings, jogging, whatever. I don't know what it's going to be, but it is going to be something, some, some things here. I have my budget tracker. And my budget tracker actually starts in January 2021. Um, it goes from January, February, March, all the way to December. So this is why this one is not filled yet because it is not 2021. It goes for the income, what I'm bringing in, um, the mortgage, rent, taxes, home renters, electricity, gas, water, trash, phone, sales, internet, cable, dining out, clothes, emergency fund. It goes all of that good stuff. And then in the green, it has my savings here. And I feel like this is really good to have in a planner. So this is how the days will look and then i am in august 2021 so we can go to april 2021 august 2020 now we go to april 2020 um it starts like this it has march the month before april and then it has made the month after april and it goes all the way from 1 to 30th and it has notes on the side which i actually love on another page on the bottom row it actually has the to do's so what we have to do and this is on almost every page. Um, it has your to-dos, um, your, your important things that you need to get done right away, your notes, how that looks. And then this is your hydration. So we all know that we're supposed to drink one to eight cups of water a day. It has eight droplets of water. And how many drop, how many cups you, you take, you just mark it on in. So that's one cup, two cup, three cups. And that is your water tracker, basically. And it's on every sheet. So we have two types of um, note taking. We actually have this type of note taking right here with the lines in it. We have the calendar, how the calendar looks. Mm -hmm. 